back here at Dodger Stadium with one of the best pitchers in the league, Tony Gonsolin. This season you're doing so great. Obviously still early, but you have the best ERA in baseball and you are one of the top pitchers when it comes to wins. What is working for you this season? Anything differently than you work with Mark Pryor? Um, put a lot more strikes this year. Uh, trying to get ahead of guys, trying to just attack guys. Um, not being scared to throw the ball over the plate and just kind of see what happens. Tony, I always remember when you came here uh -huh. and I always had the sense that you were going to become the pitcher that you have become right now. Did you expect to improve this well when you first came up? Uh, I feel like in 19 when I first came up, it, was, it started off pretty rocky, but uh, it was definitely a learning curve. Uh, it took me a little bit to, uh, to you know, grasp that, but uh, done a lot better. Happy with how I've done this year so far. Uh, like you said earlier, there's there's a lot more season left, so uh, um, you know, got to finish strong, take it one start at a time. But overall, uh, I'm very pleased with how this year's going. When you're pitching and you see all the defense, the great defense that you have behind you, they put runs to on the board. How much do your teammates inspire you? Uh, yeah, um, we definitely have one of the best defenses in baseball. Uh, it's amazing to go out there uh, and watch these guys play. I have the best seat in the house to, uh, to watch these guys play defense. And then uh, just knowing that, that the offense, uh, if they haven't started early, it'll come around. You can't keep this offense down. Uh, like the, they're, they're one of the best offenses, let alone defenses. So uh, it's incredible to watch these guys play every day. Like you said, and how much support and encouragement did you get from your fellow pitchers? You always had like a pretty good tie group. Yeah, it's been nice uh, adding uh, and uh, TA and Keeney. Uh, mm -hmm. They've been a big support this year for me. Um, I probably talk to them the most in the dugout when I'm not pitching. And then uh, David Price is probably another big one who's always been an advocate of me. Um, he would text me after every time I threw in 2020 and uh, you know, just saying good job or whatever. So it's been awesome to have, have guys like that around. When David Price had worked together and he's exchanging ideas on pitches and stuff like that and techniques uh, in the past. We, didn't, we haven't talked too much mm -hmm. about pitching, just kind of supported each other. Mm -hmm. It's been a huge support, support for me, a little mentor, uh, just going out there and trusting my stuff and, and knowing that I'm gonna, I, can do, I can do good and we'll... We know that you love cats. Um, do you have any foundation related? Uh -huh. With cats, um, or are you planning to do anything, you know, specifically about it? Uh, nothing so far. Mm -hmm. um, hoping to do something with like, uh, like no kill shelters or something mm -hmm. like that, so we can just you know save the animals. Um, you know, hopefully find homes and all that stuff. Yeah. What did Tony Gonsolin likes to do every other day? Like you know, like for fun, like besides you know basically. <clears throat> um, I'm curious. Play video games, probably the biggest one. Mm -hmm. Watch TV, uh, just binged all of Stranger Things. So uh, those are probably the two main things, just TV and uh, video games. The Stranger Things is one of your favorite shows, you would uh, say? It's, yeah, it's up there. Whenever it comes out, the new seasons, I, I always watch them pretty quickly. Any other shows or besides uh, that one? I need to catch up on Ozark. <laughs> That's a good one. That is a I good like one. Ozark. I need to catch up on that one. Uh, None that I can really think of right now. What about music? I just listen to whatever. Yeah, you you go with crazy. the flow, is that? Yeah. You pretty much just cool. What yeah. about Spanish music too? That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> I don't have any. I don't really have any uh, on my playlist, but uh, I always vibe to it when it's playing in the clubhouse or in the gym. So yeah. You try a little bit of everything. Are you yeah. a person that is always curious? Like, would you say that you are curious to learn about something different, something new? That yeah. catches your attention. Yeah, I'm not opposed to learning anything new and um, mm -hmm. uh, trying to understand it a little bit for sure. And now that you have Dave for a couple of you know seasons, getting to know him, uh, how much you know has that relationship? You know, you say it is with him. How it's growing, you know, in the clubhouse. Yeah, it's been great. Um, I think this year is a huge step for us. Mm -hmm. uh, we talked a lot in spring training. Um, just about you know what to come, what to be like, what's expected, and like uh, kind of how he envisions me going forward, kind of thing. And I think lately, like past 
uh, and like all season this year, we've been pretty much on the same page in terms of my outings and and all that stuff. So yeah, it's been a great um, having that relationship built. Good luck this season, and hopefully see you at the All Star Game too. Cool. Thank you.